video here at Patriot Hills. Patriot Hills. We've been here before. We've been here before. We filmed the video way back on my birthday uh, when we were first getting started. I think it was How Low Can You Go episode two. Uh, we're excited to be here, guys. It's chilly this morning. Pretty cold. Pretty but uh, it's an awesome golf course. Great price. Mm -hmm. Great, uh, great views. We're happy to be here. We're just happy to be out playing some golf. So hopefully we can play some good golf. Uh, we had a couple good tee balls there to start. Let's go. Let's go. Let's right. get it. Grant's just here, kind of blocked out. This is what the tough thing about this hole is. If you're not far enough right or in the center, you can be in a little bit of a tough spot. What club you got? Yeah, eight iron. Eight iron from 163. He's going to try and get it up over the right side here. A little heavy, but it's out there in position. You can get up and down from there. I can get up. And Austin hit a fantastic tee ball. That one? Not blocked oh. out. 129. Oh, this is green light all day. I got it. Not bad. On the green. Beautiful out. It's, Beautiful. It's warming up pretty fast. quickly out here. That sun is feeling strong. We've got Brands driving today. Uh, it's, Gotta it's say hot. thank it's you. Hot. Got the Celsius sponsor. Thank you. Ooh. Not really. I wish. So if you guys see this somehow, please. We love to drink it every day. Send us a DM. We're we're big advocates for Celsius. So we can do a lot for you. But, all right. Let's see where Brands is and see where his oh, next right. shot can end up. Not bad. Just in front Not of the bad. green. I can get up this is where Brands ended up. Front of the green. Come with me here. We're gonna run. Come up. You can see what he's looking at. Kind of short-sighted. A little bit. All right, Brant. Let's see what you got. Brant's bringing it up from down there. Let's see where his ends up. It's not too bad. These greens are firm today. They're a little wet, a little cold. Just ran to the back. Brant's putt for par. Long one. Probably about 50 feet. Honestly, just trying to see, but. I've seen you make these. Really good roll. It was end over end. Not yeah. bad. I gotta make that All right, Jump's got a good chance for birdie. He's gonna more than likely get a good little head start on the first hole. All right, par's a par, especially on this hole. Good start. I mean, I'll take par for sure. Oh, should have marked it. <laughs> Grant's still with about, what, about six feet? Six, seven feet maybe for a uh, bogey. Not an easy. This isn't easy. But Grant's pretty steady with these. Oh, my gosh. It was a great roll. That's good anyways. We got away there with par. Brant had to take double. Bad uh, bad luck with that chip and then the three putt down the hill. That was tough though, Brant. I mean, your chip was your chip was actually really good. You can go back on it and watch yeah. a replay of that. It's a pretty good chip. Yeah, I mean, that's the problem when you're short sighted. So short -sided yeah, yourself. short sighted yourself. You got to take your medicine sometimes and then compound that with a, a three putt. A bad side, putt. Good. Yeah, that's... But you know what, guys? There's plenty of holes out here, plenty of birdies. I mean, I, I'm not worried. Brant's been hitting the ball awesome recently. I mean, I, I'm not worried at all about about his game here. So we got a little par three. It's about 125 yards. Let's see. Let's, Let's make a birdie, man. Or one. Birdie one. All right. Pitching wedge. This is just like the same distance you just hit. Yeah. So I'm gonna just try and copy paste the shot I just hit, and hopefully hit one close. Batter, if I hit the distance, gotta go. Yeah, just short of the hole. Ooh, what club you got? I got the pitching wedge as well. You know? Pitching wedge. Pito. Right. Get it back there, man. I, I kind of babied mine. I was worried about sending it long and getting into trouble back there. Our goal today, guys, is to be aggressive. We're going for birdies. I got skunked in the last round. Oh, this is right at it too. It's another one that's just right on line. Dude, we're right next to each other. <laughs> All right, here we are. My ball plugged in the green. <laughs> Brant plugged. We've got about, we've got a long putt for sure, but I'll give you the line. I've had this one before. Please do, wow. 
Wow, we literally on the same shot. That's within a foot and a half. We did pretty good. <laughs> yeah, pretty good to hit one close to each other here. All right, let's see if we can make them now. This one's way back there. Yes, sir. Hey. Good burn. Brent has, you can see my line in the dew running all the way literally back to his mark. I mean, you can see my line running right through his mark. Uh, so he's got the exact same putt that I just had, and I gave him a pretty good, pretty good blueprint, I would say. Let's see if he can follow it up. Oh, his is bouncing. Wow. That was, yeah, yours got some bounces that mine didn't. He's going to trust this one. He's got a chance for par. It's another about six, six, seven footer. Oh, my gosh. Back-to-back -back lips, man. Brent can't catch a break to get started. Good. Brent, not a good start. No. I, I can understand the frustration. Brent, Celsius. But Celsius is making a shoot better. We do have a lot of birdie holes. I know I just said that as we were pulling up to, to two, but it, it's really true. Um, those first two holes aren't the holes that, you know, you're, you're, you're budgeting your birdie on. Yeah, like, uh, we've got some birdie holes coming up. I need them. There's six par fives out here, so. I and they're all, birdie, they're every, all pretty reachable. So. I better birdie every single one of them. I got a little bit of a, a, little bit of a banked up birdie here. I'd like to. To make another one going, let's go Keep let's let's see how low we can take it today guys all right guys austin has my number i'm down four on him through two Ooh, yeah, right. you're one under and i'm three over guys this holds a little dog leg left I'm dog leg left my trusty old three iron try to put one on the right side to have an angle at the it's only about 240 to the corner so that won't hurt being a little right. That's what I wanted. Brent's going to take three wood. He's hitting a little cut. This could work out really well. Off to a good start. Focus up. Yeah, Brent, that was the best. That was the best three wood I've seen you hit in a long time. That's perfect. Probably going to put some more. This is 102. Got 54 degree. Green light. I mean, wide open, no trouble. Just This is Austin's deadly from here. Oh. Chunky. Eighty-one yards. Hopefully, better result than mine. Uh, right, just... Plug short of the green. I need a birdie. I need, to get I need a birdie. This is green light zone. This is definitely a birdie yardage. Just pulled. All right, you got to put at it. After it's chunking up a little short, right on line though. But if you guys know Austin, this is pretty good. Just like that. You got about 25. Right, literally perfect distance. Yeah, pen high, just 25 feet for birdie. Focus up on speed line here. I like it. I'm feeling good for this one. Little, uh, speed was good. Wow, I guess actually it rolled out a little bit more than I thought. All right, we're gonna clean this up. Yep. Awesome to clean up his par. Sadly, I could not get one birdie. Get up and down. That's all right. I, I made a par. Brent got a par. I got up and yes. down. My chipping <laughs> has been weak recently, so that felt good. Felt that good, but good uh, this next hole is really fun. So great par three. It's a great par three. We ha still haven't hit driver yet today. Oh, yeah. but hey, well, Joe Man's just wait. Once I start pulling driver, that's when I'm in that's, trouble. That's I I'm think coming. that's honestly I'm coming for. that's what's going on. I don't have to hit driver, and Brent can't hit driver, <laughs> so <laughs> that's what's saving us right now. Let's go to the next one. It's par three here. Good one. Good one. It's 180, 182, but playing 160. One. As you can see the pin right there. Just short. 
Yeah, I'm like just short. Brent here. I'm here. Seven iron. Seven iron. This is a tough hole. It's. I am gonna try to play the cut into this. Yeah. I have an easier time cutting the ball. Brent's gonna play a cut. Cut some yardage off. Get it close. It's just overturning a little bit, right. but it's gonna catch a piece. Just short. All right, Brant's bringing his up. I think he got caught in the tree. Got to bring it up here. Got short sided, tough shot, way uphill. Let's see if we can hit one close. Actually, really good shot. Very good shot. That's good. Tricky up and down. Not bad. Let's see if Brant can clean this up. Get a three and move on. We both got a little long putt here. Turn a lot. Oh, just barely. This and get out. Nice. Be a great up and down. Make a three. Yeah, that's a tricky one. Yep. Yeah. Alrighty. You're, you're even. Yeah, even through there is fine. Through right. four. We got a part five coming up. Through four, I'm even. Grants, what do you so we're not off to a good start, but uh, we got plenty of holes. Greg gets to bring out the driver. That's his most confident club. I need club. that club. You got this. Let's the go. Only club. Let's let's hit some good ones here. Get off to a good start. Maybe make birdie. Maybe make even. I need that. Let's see. I need whatever. <laughs> I need something. Something red. Par five. Par five. Let's get off to a good start. Nice tee ball. Yeah, that's good. Good tee ball. Great. Boom. That'll do. All right, now this is Brant's wheelhouse right here. Hits the driver great. Right. Far and straight, it's one of the best drivers you ever get a chance to play with. You can tell there was some anger in that one. It's kind of drawing. Good ball, it's in, pl in play still. All right. 246 playing 252. Got I think I'm gonna hit three iron. I'm gonna see if I can just land it on the green and let it run back. This pin's back there too. It's got 241, similar, similar shot to me. He's gonna take three wood because not a good lie. Into the wind, guys. The wind's picking up quite a bit. That pin again is way back there. Ball's below his feet and a little choke three wood punch. Oh man, what a great strike. That's just it's just bleeding because you can't yeah just left you can't really do anything about that. that was a really good shot though all right so it is masters weekend we're playing i don't know when you guys see this video but it is masters weekend for us so we're gonna Great say time. excluding augusta national what course are you playing in the world in the world not just to us what course do you do you get to play right now excluding augusta what would, what would you choose i'm gonna take Bamp Springs up in Alberta, Canada. That, the one that you see in the video games. That course is so cool, dude. Like, I would like to play that one. Okay. Or you do the old course or something. I, I think I personally... I gotta go iconic. Probably, like, Pebble Beach. Pebble Beach or Spyglass. Yeah, or Spyglass. Ooh. There we go. Hey, there's your, that's, there you go. That's where Lefty Golf Girls playing. You guys, Austin, a little bit short. He's probably about 65 yards or so. guys Brant's got a real interesting one he's kind of all above his feet coming uphill it's uh, interesting just short Brant bringing it down for this is for birdie I've had one long one drop today come on good line a little bouncy man good putt though Good speed. All right, here we go. Austin made one bomb today. Hole's looking pretty big for him, so. Oh, if you had the pace. All right, Brant, just clean it up. Three footer. Yep. Keeps us even through this whole five. Brant is four over still. Four over. So we've got. Little par four, 
I love I love this hole coming up. This is a really beautiful. Oh, it's hole. A, it's fun. It's a really nice hole for wedges. If you hit a good drive, you can have a wedge in, and it's fun. So let's let's get started with the good drive part. Yes. <laughs> All right, Austin's opting with the three iron. He said he didn't feel comfortable with the driver. He's playing smart today, so that's good. That'll do. That'll do, donkey. Brant though is a laser off tee, so he's taking driver. I don't know why. I'm just I'm feeling good with the three iron, and this hole is not overly long, so I'm gonna hit it. Just up the left, it's not gonna hurt anything though. Good ball. All right, guys, the breeze is picking up here. It's windy. It's actually into the face. You can't really tell, but it is. Austin, 146, got a nine iron. Get it back there. Pins in the center. Oh, he striped it well. Stop drawing. That's a good shot, though. Good shot. 140, what'd you say? 138. Oh, 138, sorry. 138. Brant's got nine iron, too. Uh, this should be perfect distance, man. It's going to be full. It's in the wind, guys. This is it's, it's breezy coming up. There's nothing behind this hole. So the wind is just whipping. Slow, though. It might work out. Slow. Not bad. Balling it up just a little short. He's got a pretty straightforward chip here. Uh, lots of green to work with. A little bit of a slope left to right. Oh, the strike was good. The slope's gonna just take that one. Just pulled. Not too bad though. Austin with his birdie putt. He says he likes it, so that's scary for me. Wow, dead center short. Wow. Caught up in the purse string. Should have been aggressive. Brent said he's going to get the ball rolling here, guys. He is focused up. Going to make – this would be a good confidence booster. Get your par and get uh, on to the next. we got a couple par fives coming up after a little short par three. Great putt. That's it, Brent. Let's go. So that's got to be a good confidence booster for you there. Get that nice putt that rolling. Was All right, let's go, man. That was needed. That was needed, Brent. Now on the par train. Back to back, I think. A little par from me. Two short putts in a row. But I'm okay. Let's go to this par three and make a hole in one. That'll settle the, uh, settle if I the score. If I make a hole in one, I, I, I will take a loss today and I'll just be like, I made a one. So neither one of us have actually ever made a hole in one, surprisingly. The closer I've had a hole in three. I was 16 or 17. I was playing with my dad at this course called Shemung Hills Golf Course in. <laughs> Uh, Howell, Michigan. Uh, great golf course. Grew up there. It's just kind of like a mom and pa course. Um, and on the 18th hole, it's 230 yard par, uh, par three. First one hit three iron, shanked it out of bounds. That threw me another box. I had to read T and uh, made that one. So it was unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> Good par. <laughs> All right. So, so holes 150s, what? 151? Uh, playing 143. Playing 143. Downwind. Austin's got P-dub, so he's swinging good. I got to catch him. He's playing, he's playing good. Oh, this is, drinks on him? Figured... All right, puttering up to All right, Brant's got nine iron. Honestly, this is like a delicious pin right now because it is, it is a decent yardage and it's wide open in front of there. So let's go, Brant, let's see what you got. Just left it out a little left. Should be just putting though. Yeah, you're putting. That's not bad. Grant with a long one for birdie. Hole seven, part three. Beautiful hole, guys. Downhill, a little bit of water. Nice houses along the way. Wow, that did not turn at all. Look at this, look at this slope. Huh. I hit it right there. It was a really good putt, really. But I can't believe it didn't break. Probably about 35 feet, but straight up the hill, so he could be aggressive with it. Wow. That came turning in. It hit a little bounce. Mm-hmm. Good part, though. Yeah. That is a good part, but I do want to see it. hit a little bounce and kick it out. Do you want to see it? Because I know you're tap-in game. <laughs> Rance, not sure what this one's going to do, because... This, I can't believe this putt didn't break for you, Brant. That is. But I'm scared. It's a right to lefter. But I just gotta go in confidence. 
for you righties watching, right to left, not good for us. Yep, easy. Let's go. Good, good par. Thank you. I am still even. Seven. Grant is still four. Still four. Need to get some. Need to get some. Uh, some We got two par fives. So this this course ends on two par fives. There's three on each side. So five. We played a few holes ago. It's par five. And coming up here, eight and nine are both pretty reachable par fives. This this hole's kind of long. I need it. Grant needs it. This hole's kind of long. To snap with it. I need to, I need to go, <laughs> I've got that shot. I need to go bomb. Grant would go, go bomb. bomb. Bomb, bomb, honestly. Like, it's a driver three wood all day, but nine is like driver four or five iron, I mean, really. So. But I need some birdies. Actually, I don't even hit driver. I can't get skunked out on birdies. No skunks. All right, let's go. All right, par five here. Beautiful looking golf hole. Downwind. This is licking the chops. And Austin said, screw your snap hook. I'll raise you one and go right down the middle. All right, lick of the chops. I hit a high one to ride the wind. I need all I can get. Brant's usually 10 yards longer, maybe 15. And he's chasing me down, so he's gonna hit a good one here. Oh my gosh. Yep, that one was torched. <laughs> that was so good, that was so straight. Two good drives. Let's see who got it. I, I bombed mine, but Austin bombed his. Brent, he hit the draw. Brant bombed his. I hit a draw. I'm hoping that helped me. And I hit it. You actually hit yours really high. Brant's drive's normally low, so when it's downwind, I like it because I hit the ball high naturally. But Brant, yours was torch. Bombed. <laughs> Let's see where we end up, guys. I'm, I'm curious it's to see. It's actually pretty even. I don't know. Yeah, we did actually have two good drives. What's the length of this hole anyway? All right, length of this Let's, hole. Let's we'll calculate this drive. Let's see how far 585. we get. 585. 585. Wow. Uh, I, we hit this good. Let's see how far we hit it. Fine, ended up. Mine ended up here. Gotta look at the green. Brant's just passed me. Dang it, Brant, you just got me. Got two. I have 265 playing 245. So that means we hit 320. Yeah, I 320. So Brant probably hit his like 325, 330. Let's see, man, that's a good drive, man. This thing, you centered it too. Mine's right side of the fairway, like I expected. What you got? A six, but probably playing downhill, probably like 255. Yeah, 255. Yeah. Perfect, 20 yards down, yeah. 265, downhill, playing like 245. Yep. I'm gonna try to hit this on the front part of the green, let it run back. I mean, I don't think I can carry it all the way there today. I'm all right. Gonna... This is a green light special for you, though. I might club down. No, nah, I'm gonna hit this. I mean, you have room long, and I... Yeah, no, I'm, I'm going to get it there. My four iron could get me further. I should have hit four iron, dude. I can't hit this thing off the deck. All right. Brent can definitely do better than than mine. I got, I got my three hybrid here. Uh, honestly, I'm just trying to get on the green somewhere yeah, respectable. For sure. All right. Let's go. Oh, this hit well. It's turning. I don't know if you can see it land on camera. Good ball. Good ball. All right, Austin, 74 yards. Honestly, green light. No, nothing trouble up there. Brant ended up pin high. Good shot. Good shot here, man. Let's see you get up and down. Easy birdie. I bought it up just long. It didn't strike it very good. Good chip. Wow, that did not even try to stop. Uh, didn't even try at all. A little more height. All right. This is an odd one for Jumbo. Jumbo typically chips this, but he's elect to pull the putter. Simmer down. That was actually hot. These greens are they're heating up. I am giving this one away. Brant's got a good look at birdie. Line it up. How you feeling over it? Right to left here, so. Little right to left. You should have had a decent read off of mine. Decent, right? Oh, go a little. Good line. Right, Easy par, though. Par, I'm sweating over my par. <laughs> Brant's on a par streak. <laughs> All right. Jump in about seven, eight feet for his par. 
Oh. That's got to be the worst bogey in bogey's history. All right, Austin's shaking in his boots now. I got the tee. I'm four over. He's even. No, I'm one over now. Oh, one over now. Yeah, one over because I bogeyed. I'm not used to you making bogeys today. Bogeyed so. the par five from 240 out dead center. Yeah, but, uh, short game mishap there. Austin, not giving tee back. So. Whatever. Okay. So Brent has the tee. Yeah, driver. driver. This is another par five, guys. This one's pretty short. Pretty good ball. Pretty good. All right. Austin elects to hit driver. Yeah, I normally don't. Normally doesn't on this hole, but he's really good. He's actually hitting the driver solid today, so. You hit it good again. All right, so Austin and I both hit great drives. It's a par five and Austin's only 165 in. Yeah. <laughs> He's hitting eight iron because the, if you can tell on the, it's straight uphill here, this green. Oh, it's right at it. I, I Sir, that's an eagle putt. Brent hit his drive so good. 137 into a par five. Again, guys, though, this plays uphill so much that even though we have a short yard of gin, it's really not that easy. So Brent's got nine iron. Someone close. Put one up there by me. Oh, I pulled just it. pulled a little tug, but it should have a, a look at it at least. Yeah, probably just on the green, just right. Oh. We thought Branch was putting, but it ended up just long. Wet. The sand is wet. The green is all sloping away. It's into the wind, though, at least. It's kind of a tricky little bunker shot, though. Oh, man, that was struck so well. Good shot. Really, really not bad. That's a good look at it. Eagle, go. Wow, I thought it'd be much quicker. It's I downhill down there. I know. All right. Brant's got a nice look here for Brady. Putting up the hill. Up the hill. It's going to break off the table. Actually. It's going to break a lot. Yeah, mine broken. It's a little bit of a slope. Didn't really break that much, but par. I paring from 136 yards. All right, awesome for Birdie. Get back to even. Wow, that's terrible. Two pars on a short par five. Guys, that's gonna be it for the front, the front nine. nine. What, I ended up uh, one over. One over, and I farther. finished four. Brands four over, so we but, still got a whole back nine ahead of us. Try so and get some birdies. Try and get back to even. So let's see what we can do. Let's go.